ਬਾਬਾ ਦਿਖਾਈ ਦੇਣਾ Leading human rights activist Noor Own La and nine others were arrested on the 13th of August for demonstrating without permission against the Lapadang copper mine. Last week she was sentenced to two years imprisonment with labor. She was charged with sedition and disturbing public tranquility. An ethnic Karen from Morbi Township in Rangoon, Noor Own La has spent her life campaigning for human rights and democracy. The veteran protest leader is best known for leading weekly prayer meetings at Shwedagon Pagoda. Since 2004, her Tuesday prayer group has met to pray for the release of Aung San Suu Kyi and now for all the other political prisoners. The authorities have repeatedly tried to break up the prayer protest, but such was the media attention that activists were inspired in other cities to set up similar campaigns. In 2009, Noor Own La and five others were arrested after they visited a pagoda. Noor Own La spent two years behind bars before being released in a presidential amnesty in 2011. Since her release, she's continued to take part in street protests, calling for the release of all remaining political prisoners. Since then, the government has bowed to pressure and released hundreds of political prisoners. Noor Own La's role as a political activist started many years ago. She was the head of the women's wing of the National League for Democracy until 2004. In 2007, she took part in the monk-led demonstrations of the Saffron Revolution. Then, on the 13th of August this year, Noor Own La joined local demonstrators in Monwa, calling for the suspension of the Lapadang mining project. The copper mine is responsible for the confiscation of over 7,000 acres of farmland. And the forcible relocation of hundreds of villagers. After a brutal crackdown on protesters in November, the president appointed a commission headed by Aung San Suu Kyi to investigate the crackdown and the mining operation. But the commission reported back that the project should be allowed to continue. <laughs> After a tense standoff, police arrested Noor Own La and nine others. Rights groups slammed the authorities for excessive use of force. She was charged with protesting without permission, and a trial is pending. However, a more serious charge of sedition was brought against Noor Own La, and last Thursday she was sentenced to two years imprisonment. Noor Own La's lawyer was barred from the courtroom during the trial, and he denounced the verdict as unfair. Noor Own La's sentence suggests that although the government is willing to offer some new freedoms, it still retains absolute power, and it's a stark reminder that those new freedoms can be snatched away at any time.